Hello everyone, welcome back to the Wisconsin Greg Show. Uh, we're under a tornado warning right now. Uh, first started out as a watch and then they gave, this is our actual, our second warning so far right now. Um, looks a little bit worse on video than it does look out in person, but it is getting all of a sudden kind of dark out there. Um, <clears throat> I haven't seen nothing too serious happen yet. Uh, they said take shelter immediately. They said that the last time and uh, just doesn't seem like nothing's happening much. I got the police scanner on listening. I don't hear a whole lot going on. Sorry there's some raindrops on my window kind of messing up the focus here and there. But keeping an eye on it. I am glad I got all the soybeans planted. I finished yesterday. I, yesterday I finished. I had maybe a half an acre left around the woods. I had to wait. That was a little too wet around there. Uh, kind of actually almost got stuck around the woods uh, the day before. Um, so I went through and uh, planted everything except for around the woods, uh, which was like about 39 and a half acres. And then I went yesterday and I ran the field cultivator. Kept I ran it through the night before and I kept running it through the, during the day, trying to dry it out. And that afternoon I finished planting it. So that's good. The corn is coming up. It's so small you can't see it. That's where the field right out in front of me here. Uh, if you walk up there, you can start to just barely see the roll, rows of corn. <clears throat> so that's coming. So hopefully we can get past this part here and hopefully we don't end up having any tornadoes. We don't need that right now. We've got enough problems in this world. But I just thought I'd give you a quick update on what's going on here. And uh, if anything serious does happen I'll uh, continue on with this video but right now I'm just gonna put it on pause well just got a third uh, warning to take uh, shelter immediately uh, I'm really keeping an eye on it I'm only like a few steps away from the basement so but I don't see a whole lot but it is a little bit breezy out here and the clouds are a little bit scary right above my house I don't see any tails forming yet so that's a good thing but I could see where the conditions are very favorable for it just the way it feels out here That little looks like it could form into a tail, but it isn't yet. How beautiful it is over there. Some pretty weird looking clouds though. Now the wind is picking up. I don't hear no train sounds yet. They say when you hear a train sound, run. Seen some big old lightning just to the west of me over here. Let me focus over here for a little bit. Neighbors' cows, they don't think nothing of it. They're just out there eating away just like it was another day.
that real dark streak over there and the wind is really picking up I think I might be running in the basement here real quick I don't know if you've seen that some lightning over there I just seen the cow way, way back there running. Here's some thunder. See the trees blowing. It's getting windier. side of the house real quick and just take a quick peek put you on pause for a second uh, there wasn't much going on, on the other side of the house just a little bit of lightning and thunder um, this side is starting to clear up a little bit a couple times it was looking a little bit scary uh, but I think it's clearing up I think it's gonna move uh, kind of northwest of me so I'm gonna go back in the house and just watch out the window for a little bit and see what's going on if it gets really bad, I'll just set my camera in front of the window and I'll go down in the basement. And I'll just let the camera keep videotaping. Well, it cleared up. It's been probably a half an hour, 45 minutes later. And it looks like got another batch coming. It's starting to sprinkle rain a little bit again. We've had some off and on. Listen to the thunder and the lightning. I've seen some really, really big um, lightning strikes, and that's why I came out here. I was hoping to get some of them on camera. But of course, when you come out here to get lightning, it doesn't lightning. <laughs> I haven't received any more notices to get down in the basement or to seek cover, so that's a good thing. Wait a couple more seconds. I just see. Listen to that sound, rolling thunder. Weather can change so quick around here, it's unreal. Temperature wise and rain wise and sunny to cloudy, it's just unbelievable how the weather changes here in Wisconsin. Usually always get rain during Memorial Day weekend. Just about, you can just about count on it. I'd, if I had to bet money, I would bet money on it raining. I don't know if you can hear them birds. Killdeer, as they call them. That's what their name is, killdeer. I haven't seen any for quite a few years. And when I was younger, I used to see them all the time. Now I'm seeing them again. Oh, 
Also, some barn swallows flying around here. They don't seem to have a problem flying around in the rain. Looking for a mosquito. Well, I'm going uh, to put you on a pause for a minute, and if anything else happens exciting, I'll be right back with you. I got some macaroni and cheese cooking. I got to go take care of it. Well, it's just getting a nice rain out there now, so I'm going to end this video. And thanks for watching, everyone. We're all safe here, and uh, we'll catch you on the next Wisconsin Greg show. Bye now.